Hello everyone! I am so excited that you're in Zingular University 202. Like Monica said, you are in this group because you are ready to rock this business. And I tell you what, our 101 is kind of an introductory to the business. The 202 is the meat and potatoes get ready to get out of your comfort zone and let's get this party started. Okay, so this is going to challenge you a little bit more. Are you ready for the challenge? Um, my job is to talk to you a little bit about your social media presence. And I'm here to tell you that people are literally making $200,000 a month with Zingular because they were not scared to get out of their comfort zone and plug their amazing business opportunity and products on Facebook. I mean, I know that there's a lot of different social media options. We've got Pinterest where you can create boards and do pins, uh, you know, pin different things. Um, I've done that. I haven't gotten as much success there, but I'm sure I'm not as active, to be honest, on that. There's also Twitter out there. If you could teach me how to do Twitter, I would love you forever. There's also Instagram out there, and I know that you can do lots of pictures and um, I have a new distributor and she's doing that. Um, Snapchat, people are doing it on Snapchat. People are doing it on LinkedIn, buying um, different ads. There's lots of different social media options for you to grow your business. Um, another one that I just thought of and it just lost my mind, hopefully it'll come back. Um, it will come back, right? Um, darn it, oh, YouTube. Um, I know that's not social media, but you guys, I have a YouTube channel and I've had people find me through my YouTube channel. Don't be scared to do lots of videos and getting on YouTube. I think that's a huge thing, um, especially with the future. Um, everybody's wanting their own YouTube channel. So do that, okay? Um, brand yourself um, as a Zingular representative on YouTube. So let's just back up a little bit and talk about Facebook. And there's two components when we talk about Facebook, right? There's our personal wall, there's groups, and then there's the Facebook Messenger app. And if you don't have the Facebook Messenger app on your phone, let's get it on your phone. You're gonna need it a lot. What I love so much about social media and Facebook is um, it's going to get you to contact lots of different people all over the country all over the world. You guys, Zingular is in 32 different countries. Facebook has the ability of reaching out to all these different countries all on Facebook. So you literally can have an international business because of Facebook, okay? Um, Facebook allows you to have, as you know, or you don't know, 5,000 friends. We have to up your friends on Facebook. We have an executive with our company that she um, only had 22 friends when she joined us um, with Zingular. And I'm not kidding, she still makes $10,000 a month. But she had to up her friends and get more friends on Facebook. So you'll notice under your friend list that it will say suggested friends, okay? It's really important that you don't just, I don't just go in there and just friend anybody and everybody. I look at them. I look at their walls. Are they positive people? Do they have a following? Do they, when they post a picture, do people like it? Like, do people like them? You guys, we get to choose who we want to go to into business with. Um, and when you get started with this, you should be talking to your new people all the time, probably multiple times a day. So, you know, let's just friend people. Also with your friends list, you have a lot of friends that are just not interested in Zingular at all. Let's wing out those friends that aren't interested, you know, or if you love them, of course you love them, so keep them. Um, but it's really important that we make your friends list work for you and what you're promoting, okay? Another thing that I want to talk to you about is being positive on your personal walls. You guys, people are, um, this is what we call an attraction marketing business. If you are talking about how tired you are or, you know, like um, being all negative, talking about a clerk that made you mad or, you know, talking about why you got a bad day, people don't wanna follow negativity. They want to have what you have when you are positive. 
leave people the lasting impression that you're always there for them. If you're a natural caring person, they're going to be attracted to you, okay? And when we talk about it being an attraction marketing business, I don't want you going on your Facebook wall. I don't want you acting like you're the expert on um, everything under the sun. You know what? We all have different things about us that attract people to us. So on my Facebook wall, I hope to goodness that you can tell that I'm a God girl. I hope to goodness that you can tell that I love my foster care kids. I love my husband. I love my kids. I hope you can tell what my passions are in life. And I want your wall to reflect your passions in life. I don't want it to look like you're a know-it-all. <laughs> I've had some distributors that have gone onto their walls and acted like the expert on so many different topics, and that does not attract people to you. Number one, it's not duplicatable. People know that they aren't the expert on everything and that they can never do what you do. But if they know they can just post about their life and their interest, they're gonna be more apt to be able to duplicate that, okay? So we have to be duplicatable. Also, we don't wanna be posting about Zingular every hour, every two, every three hours on our wall. What a lot of people try to do is do one Zingular post a day and then do one personal post a day. And how you've seen it in 101 is when you're new, we do not want you putting Zingular on your page. We have to brand you first. We have to, um, Get your warm market questioning what you're doing and how we do that. It's not that we're wanting to keep Zingular from them. We just want them to have to reach out to you, okay? So don't put Zingular on your wall until we get you branded as a branded Zingular representative. Once we get you branded, then you can hashtag Zingular all day long, okay? Um, because we do. We want Zingular to be a household name in every single person's home. You guys, only less than 50,000 people are using our products from coast to coast, let alone internationally. So we want people, when they hear the word Zingular, we want them to say, oh my gosh, my good friend Kara's doing that. I'll have to reach out to her. So we want them to reach out to you in time. Just be patient. Um, also, on your personal, on your post about Zingular, do not say, message me for information. Leave a message below. You know what? They're going to do that. And that sounds so salesy, okay? We want it to sound much more like excitable post in 101. You saw some examples of um, how to peak interest. And so use some of those posts that are in the comments below. And you'll notice on every single one of them, we don't say PM me or comment below if you want info. That just sounds salesy. And we're really all about um, how we make people feel. We don't want to come across as professional salespeople because people, quite frankly, don't want to be sold on anything. They want it to be their idea. That's what makes them successful, okay? Um, some other things that you might just think about is um, we are blessed by an amazing corporate office that always gives us promos. And we love to create hype on our walls. We love to um, say, oh my gosh, this deal's almost out. I'm so excited. So many people are getting started. You know, creating hype, creating um, people to need it quickly is going to help you. Um, I had one more thing that I wanted to talk about and then I lost it. Um, just know this, that one person can literally change your organization. Um, it really doesn't take several people in order to make you successful with Zingular. You really only need to find a couple and that can change your whole organizational output. So the more friends that you have um, through social media, the more apt you are, what we call them is the green M&Ms, the people that really are gonna be on fire, be your biggest leaders and um, are here to stay. So um, follow Zingular, um, their YouTube channel, follow their um, Facebook um, wall, their Twitter account. You're gonna get some great ideas from this. Last but not least, this was the other thought that I had that I forgot to write down, compliance. We have to be compliant in our post. We can't make false medical claims, guys. We can't say you're gonna be cured if you take this. So please make sure that you get with your upline on what maybe is compliant, what is not compliant when writing your personal story, when taking other people's stories, okay? And then last but not least, 
you will see, I think Maite or Monica had mentioned this as well, that we have our onlookers group. That's a group that we use with um, Facebook. Put all of your people in onlookers, okay? And then we're gonna private message them through Facebook Messenger. Guys, I promise you, you can have an amazing business opportunity if you follow all of these great tips that we've given you. And Facebook social media is gonna be huge to you because um, I just can't believe how easy it makes it. It's just strictly on your phone. Wherever your phone goes, you have a business. You don't have to invest in gobs of different equipment to make this work, okay? Um, going last, another point I thought of is going live on your personal walls is huge because it pops up that you're live in that group on your wall and so people then go and watch you. So don't be scared to do live videos on your walls too. Videos are huge, okay? So I know we could be here, I've already been here about 10 to I guess 11 minutes. I could be here for hours probably talking to you about some social media stuff, but I wanted to give you the basics and that's what this is, is a basic overview of how to use Facebook and social media. So um, we're so excited again that you're in 202.